channel in this today's videos we will learn about how to arrange uh, a life cycle assessment results uh, conducted in CIMA Pro into an EPD format so let's get started with so I have done a life cycle assessment in CIMA Pro uh, where you see the, the network of the life cycle assessment of a bike life cycle with aluminium frame so i'm just uh, yeah please don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more videos so i just uh, yeah, zoom out a little bit so that we, we could see all the processes in our flowchart so so I'm just making sure that all the required uh, processes are, are visible in this flowchart. So here is the group uh, analysis group. Uh, so we have to change these groups uh, names in accordance to the uh, EPD format. So you see that the EPD uh, format is uh, look like this one. And then let's change all these groups into name all these groups in accordance to the EPD format. And then we can put uh, the, the boxes into the relevant group. So here I'm just changing the names of the given list of analysis groups but you can add uh, more groups if required so for example like in this case i'm just adding more groups by clicking on the add button The groups already according to the EPD format, so we just have to add the process in, in the element uh, analysis group. For example, now we click on the raw materials production, then we know that all these are raw materials uh, for the production of a bike. So we're just clicking on the raw materials uh, boxes, and then they are going to add it. Transport activities there is no transport activities in manufacturing of the bike, which is our bike assembly. Then transport we have no transport activity here in our case. Yeah, this is uh, transport A4. We just click on this one, but it's not adding no problem somewhere. And the assembly. Okay, use phase processes. The use phase is actually repair and maintenance and so on. Then we have end of life disposal scenario. And then reuse, which is a benefit of recycling of materials. So now we have added all these relevant processes into the relevant boxes. So let's look at the impact assessment table. Yeah, so now Sigma Pro have arranged the impact, life cycle impact, in accordance to the given analysis groups. Yeah, the same things can be seen in the tabular form. Yeah, you can export these into the Excel format. So just click on the export, and then yeah. So thank you for watching this video, and hope to see you again.